Hi everyone, welcome to Cook Stacy Cook. Today we are making bok choy and beef stir fry. This is another delicious and healthy dish you can easily make at home. The beef is juicy and tender. The bok choy is flavorful and crisp. This dish is definitely restaurant quality, and I will show you step by step how to make it. Let's get started. First, we need to finely mince five cloves of garlic, and prepare four slices of ginger. Next, we need some bok choy. Bok choy is Chinese cabbage, and some have green stems, while others have white stems. While buying bok choy from the market, it is better to buy the smaller ones because they are more tender and less fibrous. Cut the bok choy into halves or quarters depending on its size. Then rinse them thoroughly. Pay close attention to the space between the stems because sometimes a little bit of dirt can be trapped there. While we let the bok choy drain, we will cut the beef. Cut the beef into slices. Make sure you cut across the grain of the beef. Basically, any cuts of beef you can buy from the market will work for this recipe. Marinate the beef with soy sauce, oyster sauce, dark soy sauce, a little bit of sugar, a tiny bit of baking soda, some cornstarch, and water. Mix everything evenly. And then mix in a touch of oil. It is important the oil is added after the marinade have been mixed in. The last thing we need to prepare is some cornstarch and water mixture. Add some cold water to the cornstarch and stir until there is no more clumps left in the mixture. Now we are ready to cook. Add some oil to a hot pan over medium high heat. Then add the ginger slices to the oil. Let the ginger slices sizzle in the oil briefly to release its flavor. Then add a little bit of sugar and salt to the oil. And immediately add the bok choy. Stir fry the bok choy for about one minute. Our goal here is to cook the bok choy to about fifty percent. So depending on how much bok choy you are cooking, you may need to adjust the time. When the bok choy is about 50% cooked, add a touch of rice wine and continue to stir fry until the rice wine evaporates. Now we can remove the bok choy from the pan. Add a little more oil to the pan if needed. And we will stir fry the beef. Add the beef to the pan and spread them out to pan fry briefly. Then turn them over to briefly pan fry the other side. After pan frying both sides, add the garlic and mix it with the beef. Also, add a touch of rice wine and stir fry until the rice wine evaporates. Then add a little bit of oyster sauce and dark soy sauce, and continue to stir fry until the color of the beef looks even. Now we can add the bok choy back to the pan. Stir fry the bok choy and the beef to mix them together, and then we can add the cornstarch and water mixture. Remember to stir the mixture before adding it. The cornstarch mixture should boil quickly and turn into a sauce. At this time, give the bok choy and beef a few quick toss so that they are covered with the sauce, and we can remove them from the pan. Look at this bok choy and beef stir fry. Pair this up with some rice, and you have a delicious and healthy dinner ready to go. If you like our video today, please share it with your friends and family. Let me know your thoughts about this recipe in the comments. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.